Welcome back, YouTube, to another video. Reading another blog post, continuing with the joke that I am an alien and do not speak human. This was written on 11-14-2019. Everyone around me is an alien. To them, I am the alien who doesn't fit in. I am okay with this. I love standing out, being myself, blunting my light, showing my magic unto the world. Let my soul tribe find me. Let my light attract them. Let the hermetic law of attraction shine true. No, I am here. You're not alone. Let us be wheeled together. That is what life should be about. Having fun, smiles, and laughter. And, of course, don't forget the parties and social events, gatherings, etc. Your tribe will understand your wilderness. The rest of the world will mock you. Let them try. Laugh at them for not understanding you. You either rose above their wavelength or you don't understand their wildness. Come and be wheeled with me. It's more fun when you have a partner in crime. Why not be my friend and see what happens? Continuing the joke of I am an alien and everyone around me does not understand my thinking, my spirit, what have you. People will never understand you unless they are from your soul tribe, your star circle, your star group, however you want to say that. For me, whenever I was trying to find friends online, I, instead of finding people who was like-minded, instead I was harassed, bullied, cyber-bullied, attacked, abused, etc. Because they did not understand my way of thinking and instead attacked me for it, ridiculed me, and instead of helping me learn my mistake, they instead attacked me for it. I remember once I was on a forum and I typed in the welcome new members page and I wrote something like, hey, da 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 da, this is my username and what I was into and how's it going people and something like that and instead of getting good responses I got, hey, you forgot to capitalize this or you forgot to use proper English, proper punctuations, even though I did. At this point, I was already copying and pasting together other posts to make my own so I wouldn't screw up and I still managed to get cyber bullies. And to this day, they think they were in the right, even though I did nothing wrong, I did not I wasn't talking to them. I just posted a post and I used, I made sure, I used spell check, I used proper punctuations, commas, periods, and I used couple capitals. And for whatever reason, they said I did not, and to this day, they think they were right. And this is not the first time that has happened. So I learned back off. People 
with like-mindedness will find you. You will attract the right people eventually. For me, going to people was not doing anything good for me. So I learned to back off and let people comment to me themselves. So now I have a shadow work that I have to do because of this nonsense that I witnessed, that I experienced, and it is now hindering me in the future. What do I mean? Being harassed for commenting to someone or get in com mean comments, it will likely push you away from people. You will learn to not respond to anyone. You are afraid to talk to someone because you are afraid they too will attack you for literally no reason. So I learned to step back and if you comment, I comment back. I I don't know who to comment to now um, because chances are when I do post comments, they don't respond back. I've had that happen to me many times. Um, but you have to eventually get over your feels of public speaking and go for it. Um, and I am starting to heal that wound, that shadow work. It takes a lot of courage to make videos on YouTube or for anything for that reason. It takes a lot of courage to produce anything, whatever it is. Stupid bus. Once again, it takes a lot of courage to produce anything and post it to the public eye. For me, being a, a light worker, a lot of people will not relate to me. But to be attacked for spelling errors and spelling mistakes, meaning to this day they said I did not do proper English even though I did. To be attacked in that way is mind-boggling. Why harass someone over that? It makes literally no sense to me. And the other one was I posted a quote from someone, uh, some author, and I made the mistake of saying, okay, I'm not really understanding this, can someone help me? And instead of getting help, I was harassed for not knowing what the quote meant. And I'm like, really? I have a feeling you had help learning something or googling something instead of harassing someone for not knowing. So yeah, that's my past. Gotten harassed for literally no reason other than I am a noob and I'm a butthurt 10 year old. And they actually said that to me. And I'm like, no, you're a demon who is harassing someone for the fun of it. And then I actually said that to someone and then they backed off and said, I don't care if you're mad or not. And I'm like, okay. Well, he, he stopped talking after that. And another harassment was... Again, same type of thing, like, uh, you put this out here and someone will say, oh, you're, you're on drugs, you're, you're high as fuck, you're, you're insane, you're, you're a lunatic, and 
it's because they were on 3D and harassed me for it, like, really. I, to this day, cannot get over that one, and by that I mean mind-boggling. It's like, oh my god, you're a demon who was attacking me because of my light, and I still can't believe it, that one. Uh, so I left that website altogether after that because it's not the first time I kind of got a main comment here and there on that website because I showed a spout blog post on there and people didn't like it so I, I stopped and after that last harassment I, I left for good. It's not worth it when you're getting harassed and the site lets them harass you even after you blocked them. So I'm like, okay, there's a loophole in this website. So I'm, I'm just, goodbye. And I left. And it's the best thing I ever did. So you have to test the waters by posting stuff, see how people react, and if it's not doing too good and you're getting harassed, leave that place. And I did that on Facebook as well before I ultimately quit altogether because too many bad memories, too many bad, uh, just bad. <laughs> so, yeah, that's why I continue to joke that I'm the alien, no one, no one understands my speaking, meaning no one understands my throat chakra my crown chakra, my third eye and pineal gland. No one understands my wavelength. So I get harassed for it. And that's just a part of being on this planet. Constantly a threat to other people. Continue to shine through no matter what. Battle those demons get over it, time will heal the wounds, and find humor in it. For me, the joke came, and I now spread that joke constantly now. Speaking of that, um, the only other, um, I think I actually showed this before, I, I think, uh, the only other thing was I got a comment, and they said, no, I did talk about that. Never mind. And I already talked about that one, but I'll make a new video on that one. So, yeah. Until we meet again.